more coherent standing up than sitting down. <laughs> uh, first, I, I will say the obvious. Uh, it seems to me that there's no greater contradiction than having working people's retirement funds invested in a predatory lending institution like Wells Fargo. Oh. And also, uh, it, should be, it should be clear to everyone here that it's a, a, a conflict of interest to have a member of that organization in a, an advisory or an administrative position serving as a member of this body. Uh, that should not be tolerated. I grew up in Texas and my father had many battles with bankers during the Great Depression. In fact, he observed what's to me that based on his experience, gamblers and bootleggers made much better neighbors than preachers and bankers. <laughs> I certainly think that the, the banking industry and, and, and the other financial institutions played a very shameful role during the two most serious economic crises in the history of this country, the Great Depression and the current debacle. And I would hope that at the very least you would do today would be to divest from Wells Fargo. Thank you. Oh.